Hello again everyone, welcome back to EV's gallery. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel as we are really trying to reach 1000 subscribers in this month. And when you subscribe, it motivates us to bring you guys more EV related news every single day. So today I'm going to talk about CATL and it's launching a new battery. In huge news for zero emission aviation, Chinese company CATL is set to go to mass production on a considered battery. It says it can squeeze in more than twice as much as energy as a Tesla Model Y by weight while being safe enough to fly with. Lithium batteries started to avalanche of innovation when they have widely available largely because they could not solve significantly more energy by weight than other contemporary chemistries. Touchscreen smartphones, drones, all day laptops, long-range electric cars and the first generation of battery-powered aircraft were some of the results. But more energy storage is always better. You can either make things that last longer or weight less. And manufacturers have been racing to raise the bar with next-gen battery technologies. One key metric in the aviation world is specific energy. The amount of energy stored per kilogram of battery and the CATL says it's ready to set a new benchmark. The lithium-based condensed battery was launched Wednesday at the Auto Shanghai Expo with CATL claiming blockbuster energy density figures up to 500 kilowatt per kg, the highest density cells we have seen previously from Amprius which was shipping batteries at 450 kilowatt per kg more than a year ago. Meanwhile, the 4680 battery cells in Tesla's Model Y are being measured at around 244 kilowatt per kg. CATL says the new batteries features innovation in ultra-high energy density, cathode materials, innovative anode materials, separators, and manufacturing process and use highly conductive biometric considered state electrolytes to construct a micron-level self-adaptive net structure that can adjust the interactive forces among the chains, improving performance, efficiency, and stability. Other than than that, the banner figure for specific energy the company is giving little away at this point. We don't know when, what these cells will offer in terms of energy density by volume, for example, or power density, the ATL says they'll deliver excellent charge and discharge performance as well as good safety performance. The company says it's already partnering with electric aircraft companies looking to satisfy aviation grade safety and quality standards. Clearly, this will be extreme interest to anyone developing an EVTOL aircraft, provided the cells can put out enough power for VTOL operations. But electric fixed wings passenger aircraft will also get an impressive range boost out of this tech. We have seen plenty of next generation battery that promising us huge density figures over the last five years or more, but far fewer that make it to pro product stage. So it is exciting to hear that these are about to roll out in serious numbers at the upcoming months. So if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also check out our other videos as well. Have a nice day.